A nationwide chicken shortage is creating a challenge for many restaurants, and experts say it's all the result of the perfect storm of events over the past year. CBS 11's Brooke Rogers explains all new at 4:30. Supply and demand is like the chicken and the egg, but in this case, it's the chicken that's getting all of the attention. We just don't have quite enough chicken to, to meet the sudden demand. Dr. Sufal says the poultry industry slowed down production when COVID hit, but now chicken and the economy are hot again. So you have kind of a slower supply with this sudden rapid de uh, demand for particularly white meat, uh, the breast meat, uh, and the wings uh, here in the United States. It just takes time to get that production back to normal capacity. Experts say the winter storm in February was another factor. It halted production in many cases, forcing another challenge for the poultry plants. The result? The price of chicken has soared. I've never experienced this. At Palmer's Hot Chicken, owner Palmer Fortune says he's paying around 40 to 45 percent more for white meat than previously. And that affects his company's margins. We don't believe in passing that price on to the customer. Right, so we try to absorb it in other ways. It does affect labor. You know, we might not staff as many people. He says he tries to get creative, offering specials, for example, on the higher priced items. And he says he'll wait it out, hoping an adjustment in food costs is in the near future. It can't stay that way. And if it does, the industry will adjust, right? Brooke Rogers, CBS 11 News.